Hello YouTube, Batman Original 26 here bringing you another unboxing video. Today's video is my part 4 Jason Hood. I had to get another one because obviously if you've seen in my recent video, um, the other one didn't fit like I wanted it to in the neck area. Hopefully, and I pray that it does, hopefully this one fits me because the, the detail and the, the blood on this hood is incredible. Plus, he even threw in a part four uh, finished end scene um, hockey mask. Plus, it's signed by Tom Savini, which is a, if, if you guys don't know, he's a uh, well famous uh, makeup FX artist. Um, he actually worked on the first Friday the 13th movie, and I'm sure he worked on a couple of other ones, but um, it's signed by him, and this is from Rusty Dog. Um, and it's just sick, guys, and I can't wait to show you. I can't remember exactly who made the hood. I know it's Rusty Dog slash somebody. Um, I'll put it in the description, but, uh, this is coming from my friend, uh, Blue from, uh, Arkansas, I think he's from. I appreciate it, Blue. Um, I got this mask this hood combo with the hockey mask for a great deal he cut me a great deal and uh, I couldn't be more happier to get it hopefully like I said it fits um, this is the hood and the hockey mask wow it looks like it might fit, but I'm not sure yet. But it definitely, um, it's got hair on it too. And here's the Tom Savini autograph. It's by, uh, Rusty Dog Productions and Rubber Gorilla. Last ever part four hood. Right there, if you can see it. But, um... The detail on this bad boy is incredible. Here, let me take the hockey mask off. I mean, look at that. It just, it looks awesome. And in person, it's kind of got like a grayish tint to it. Kind of like in uh, part four. Because he looked a little dead almost. Apparently there's a crack in the um, in the hockey mask. He didn't say that. Maybe it's supposed to be like that. I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to email him about that. But um, this is painted up by Colin Main. And if so, I mean it's still wearable, you know. But and uh, I have my other one, but because this one is, I mean it's cool, but it's kind of kind of plain looking, you know. But uh, either way, let's try this hood on. Hopefully it fits. Please, Lord, let it fit. I, I mean, I really want to dress up as Jason. Right. About the size of my other one. But a little bit longer in the... um. The neck area. Hopefully, it looks looks all right with the shirt on. Definitely a tight fit, but that's how most hoods are supposed to be, anyways. Looks good. Um. I'm gonna go get the shirt and we're gonna see what it looks like with the shirt on so I'll be right back all right guys back again um, I put the shirt on still need to get the pants and the uh, machete but um it looks great um, my only concern is the way that the hood is made it's kind of short in the back I mean you can't see it with the collar popped up like this and hopefully, um, 
Sorry about the glare. Um, hopefully, uh, the uh, muscle suit for the shoulders will kind of pull it up a little bit. But um, try to give you a, a back. I don't know if you can tell, but it's kind of you can't really tell. But I know it's there. But um, it's just a little bit short or a little bit longer than the other hood. No major difference there, but at least it fits a little bit better. But um, this is actually it's kind of hard to hold it with. It just doesn't want to stay in there. You can't really, you don't really have that much uh, room to move your neck, but. Overall, I'm pretty satisfied with it. Um, like I said, with the shoulders, it'll kind of be like bulked up like this. So it'll be, it'll look like Jason, but um, give you a good detail on the, the blood. It does line up. With the hawk, this is actually my other hockey mask. My um, fight stuff hockey mask. But um, I I think it looks good um, compared to my other hood. It definitely um definitely does the job, and I might even display this with um this broken hockey mask let's see what it looks like sucks that it had a slip but it's like a crack i mean it might not be his fault but looks pretty good i mean you can see it right there this uh this hockey mask is definitely cheaper quality than this one but anyways guys um that's it for the video and uh hope you enjoyed my part four hood review by rusty dogs and um rubber gorilla thanks again to my friend blue and uh hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh comment below and see if i should um do a full costume um Tell me what you think. Do you like the way this looks? Uh, like I said, again, I'm going to add padding. So I'll have that kind of hunchback look that Jason normally has. Which he had in part 3, not necessarily part 4. But I like the hunchback look. And um, I got to get the pants and the machete. But uh, anyways, guys, just let me know in the comments what you think about this hood. Um, and uh, if I should finish my um project as becoming jason from part four because i love that look and i love that movie but um anyways guys don't forget to subscribe and thumbs it the la, 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 la. thumb this video up and uh share it with your friends and share it with your uh fellow collectors but um thanks guys and i uh, hope you enjoyed the video peace